Hey y'all, it's a Thrifty Southerner, back again with another video. I know it's been a long time. I am trying to get back into it. I'm in my new house. If you saw my video a couple weeks ago, you would have seen the kitchen. This is the living room. I'm trying to find a place to film. So you're gonna see me moving around a little bit. Um, I know I'm kind of crooked, but I couldn't get it straight and I wanted to film this video, so. I don't have any makeup on. This is a stay-at-home day, but I just wanted to get this video out here. It's a These Bags Need a Home, and it is Coach Edition. I asked you guys if you wanted me to break it up by brand or price point or whatever when I did these sales, when I had a lot, because I have quite a lot that I wanted needing to get rid of. Um, and most of you said by style, I mean by manufacturer. So actually this is gonna be the only one that I have enough to make one video. So I'll do this video and then I'll do um, <clears throat> another video with the rest of the bags that will be different, different kinds. All right, if you are new, thank you so, so much for watching. I would love to have you as a subscriber. And if you're already subscribed and you're not getting notifications, click the notification bell, but also you've got to go to the drop down bar and choose that you would like to see all of my videos. Because if you do custom, you'll only get notifications for certain ones and there's no rhyme or reason, guys. So do that so you can know whenever I film a video because I'm gonna to try to start filming them every week if I have enough. And I have enough to film this Thursday. So there will be a Thrifty Thursday haul. Okay. If you're interested in any of these items, you can join my Facebook group. It is a closed group. You will have to ask to join. I will approve you. And then you may ask about an item. Please give me your state so I can tell you shipping on the item. If you are not a Facebooker, you can email me. I will also leave my email address in the description box below. And I don't think I said that I would leave the group link in the description box below for my group. I'm out of practice, y'all, with all of this. Okay. Uh, first one to give me their email address will get sent a, um, invoice. You'll have an hour to pay that invoice. If you don't pay it, it'll go to the next person that would like to have it. So, let's get started. All right. I'm gonna try not to edit this so that I can just get it up. And I know I keep coming, my head keeps getting cut off. Okay. Number one. Number one, I love this purse. And if it doesn't sell, I'm gonna just keep it and use it. Okay, so this is a vintage coach. Code is 9944. Here it is, it's a crossbody. It does need to be conditioned. Again, I will do that before I send it out. I will say that the black is just a little bit faded. Compare it, I don't know if you can tell. Um, it doesn't bother me, but this happens quite often with these vintage uh, with these vintage coaches. It still has the coach tag. I don't know why it's on the zipper pull on the inside though. Oh, it looks like it, no, it didn't lose. I don't know why it's, okay, so anyway, that needs to go on the outside. Um, it's in good condition besides that. Brass, all of that. So that is number one, is $25 plus shipping. All these are plus shipping based on state. I will tell you, most shipping is going to be between $11 and $15. So, shipping has gotten very expensive and it's very slow. So, there's that. Number two. Number two is a Coach Quincy. It needs to be stuffed because it, uh, this is really not doing it justice like this. Um, these have been in a tote, so they've lost their shape. They need to just be stuffed. Here is the Quincy. Keep in mind, these are vintage purses. So, there are you know, impressions, that'll probably come out. It was probably up against one of these other purses. Um, I will also condition it. It's such a cute little crossbody with the thin strap and it also has, still has the coach tag. That one is 30. For some reason, these are very desirable and the prices on these, quite expensive. I don't know if they were more, like not as common or what, but anyway. So this is number two, Quincy, 30. When you tell me what purse you want, please let me know which number and give me a short description since they're all coach. So we don't get confused and you end up with the wrong purse. Number three. Number three is a coach tote. I cannot remember the name of this one. 
It does have some scratches. It needs to be conditioned again. I conditioned all these, but they've been, been sitting somewhere for, you know, six to eight months. So this is black. I am only charging $20 for this one, and I'll tell you why. It's got a little, like where somebody's fingernail like scraped it. Can you all see that? See that? They kind of puckered the leather. And the other thing that I had not noticed previously, but I did just notice when I opened it up to get the code, is that the zipper has started to come loose right here. That is an easy fix if you're a seamstress, or even if you just wanted to hand sew it, I would probably just leave it as is. It's just the interior pocket. All of these are raw leather on the inside, these coaches, these vintage coaches. It's just this pocket. See, it's just coming in stitch just right there. And that's normal. That's that's supposed to be like that. Okay. So anyway, because of that, someone could get a great deal and this will be $20. Again, I will condition it before it goes out. And it also still has the leather coach tag, which is nice on those vintage ones because sometimes they don't. Okay. This next one comes with its own dust bag. And it is this really pretty faux snakeskin coach wallet. Really in good condition, couple of wear spots, but they really blend in. See that? They really blend in with the snakeskin. It's really hard to actually tell what's where and what's just the snakeskin pattern. That's that. It's got a long, it has a gusseted uh, change purse, which is really nice. And it really looks great on the inside and, and on the outside. Very, very little wear. Like I said, some little places where it's got a little back pocket. This one is 25. I'm sorry. This one is 20. This is 20. $20. I looked at the wrong thing. This is number four. Faux snake skin wallet. $20. This next, these next two purses are absolutely stunning. And they go, because I checked prices for everything and then I lowered them a good bit because I need to get rid of these purses. This purse is in high demand, I guess. So. And it's beautiful. So this is number five. It's a Coach Legacy. Stunning. So beautiful. So timeless to me. Heavy duty. It's a little shoulder bag. Shoulder bags are like way back in style now. They are making a serious, serious comeback. I did just notice that it's got something on it, and, but it looks like it will come off. Hold on. Okay. I worked on that a little bit and most of it came off. It looks like somebody splattered a little bit of red sauce on here for that reason. I'm going to lower the price. I did have this at 50. I'm going to go for 40. This is number five, Coach Legacy. It's 40. So I just worked on it very, for just a second, right here and right there. And then on the top of that pocket right there. Um, it's very, very camouflaged because, I mean, you have to tip the bag up and look underneath there to see it. That's why I hadn't seen it before. So more work on it. Perhaps it would come off. This is also a vintage-ish bag. So, I mean, there are, there's like a couple of little, the edge coating. It's not the actual edge coating, but like the edge of the edge coating. And then there's like a little white spot. So anyway, overall, it's in excellent condition for a vintage bag. There are some dark spots on the bottom. Just wear, you know, not really even wear, just transfer on a, a cream bag. So anyway, that's number five. Coach Legacy, $50, beautiful, beautifully clean inside. 
I love this purse, but my neck does not love this purse because it is very, very heavy. This is a Hampton Hobo. It's $40, number six Hampton Hobo, $40. Oh, I love this purse. This is the coach that I just, I, I love it. I just think it's so beautiful. Look how well made this is. It's very heavy. This is all brass. It is a slightly darker ivory. Or I guess this is cream and this is like ivory. This has got a little bit of yellow to it. Um, it is so pretty. It does have some color change on it. And I did clean this months ago when I got it. Um, you know, it's got some wear. But I mean, it's a, it's a vintage bag. So not as vintage as the black ones. But it's a vintage, it's a vintage bag. So um, it's got the brown interior. There's a little bit of glitter. A little bit of glitter in here, which I could probably just, yeah, the whole thing comes out. So I can just dust that off. Oh, there is also, and this is why I did it for 40. You're never gonna see it, but there is a pen mark here on the um, Creed. And then there's a pen mark on the inside right there but that's like what flips over so you're literally no one's ever gonna see that but that is why these are are so inexpensive because these sell for almost well 90 and over so i'm um, also seeing a tiny pen mark here very very hard to see so it, i can do 35 on this one that might even come out it looks like half of it's come out i'm surprised i didn't notice that when i cleaned it of course it's been such a long time so anyway okay so this one's now 35 hampton hobo 35 gorgeous and that was number six Okay. Number seven is called a Nolita. This is a newer coach. Super cute. Blue satchel. Floral. It's an excellent, excellent, almost like new condition on the outside. Okay. It's got the long strap if you want to wear it as a crossbody. However, someone got marker on the inside. I have not tried to get this out because I've told you guys that when I use purses, I don't care what the inside looks like personally um, because it's the inside. No one is digging around in my bag. So that's that. I'll see that. I think that's it. There's a few little spots inside. That's that's mainly it though. So, and it looks like the stitching here is has come a little bit loose. That separates this pocket. If it were me, I would go ahead and just take that stitch out and just have it be one big pocket. But but that's just me because that would actually be more useful to me anyway. And there are a few other pen marks over here. So, for that reason, it is 25. So, that is number seven. Coach Nolita, 25. Super cute purse. This is blue. If it's coming off gray, it, it is like a light periwinkly kind of a lavender-y blue. More blue than lavender, but like that kind of a undertone. Okay, got this. It's so cute. It needs to be washed. I have not had time to wash it and I forgot and when I pulled these out again today I was like should I wash it? But then I was like if I wash it it's not gonna make it into this video. So I just lowered the price so that someone else could wash it. It's a very easy 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 thing to do. It's canvas. It's a Bonnie Cashin. Coach crossbody. It's got, see, some spots on it that need to be washed. 
Blue Dawn works like a charm. Super cute little, uh, what do you call that? Change purse. Back pocket. I love the uh, lining. So that is number eight, Bonnie Cashin, Coach, $15. The next one also needs to be washed. It has been well loved. These need to be clipped. Once those are clipped, that'll look just fine. It's got, see these, and I can do that. I can clip those. It needs to be washed though. It is an older model, Coach. Um, all the words, they're just not, they're not coming today. They're not coming today. It is a wristlet. But it, it still has a lot of life left in it. It would be beautiful once washed. This you could probably, now don't quote me, don't, I didn't say this. Sometimes this can be done. Is This could probably be thrown in the wash. I'm just saying. However, this is going to be $8. So this is number nine, Coach Wristlet, $8. It is a big wristlet, so I'm pretty sure I'm checking my phone. I'm pretty sure you could fit like a good size phone in here. All right, two more left, and these are new, very new coaches. This one I got as a gift, and I um, did not use it, and I, I, it's been sitting in my closet for a year, and so I thought, you know what, to honor that person that gave it to me, I will give it to someone else and let them purchase it who would like it. Because it's not getting any love in my closet because I don't dress up and go out, you guys. Like, I don't hardly ever, maybe like twice a year, do I like get super dressed up. And I'm, I'm not going to take, this is not something you can take to church. So, it's more of like a night out thing. Um, this is a star wristlet. It comes in a box. It was, this would be a great Christmas gift. If you're looking for Christmas gifts, fantastic Christmas gift. It is got... I don't know if you can see the little stars. And it says coach. It's still got the tag on it. These are selling also. Get him down, please. I'm not editing this video, so please. Sorry, you guys. My daughter just came in here. Um, these were, like, priced very high online. I don't know what they originally went for. It is, a, I believe, a factory item because the code is F38641. And, uh, but it's so cute. So cute. This is 40. Like I said, it would make a bomb gift. Here's your little card. I mean, it's in perfect condition. And it looks so cute in here. In its little box. I'll show you guys. So nice. So that's number 10, Star Wristlet, $40. And the last, but certainly not least, and again, one that if I went out and did more, I would keep, but again, this is a Coach Crossbody sequins. Sequin C's. Love this. They do this a lot. I love that. Um, little detail and it is in excellent condition I mean I don't know if anybody ever really oh I think we went through this I think it did have like yeah it's got a little glitter on the inside too I don't know what people are doing with all this glitter but um so it has been used but I would say it's been used once that'll be my guess like it's in such good condition this is cute too this goes down when you wear it and you've got your little coach. And the inside is beautiful. This rich purple satin lining. But there is, there is glitter. Maybe, no, that's only sequins. There's no glitter on the front, so I don't know. I don't know what people's doing with all the glitter, but I guess when you go out on the town, you need glitter. All right, this is $25. 
I know that this was kind of all over the place. I'm just getting back to the group and my head's cut off, which I despise. But anyway, um, that was it. That's what I got. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Hope you actually get the notification that I filmed a video. And if you did, give me a thumbs up, comment. Let me know that you that I came up in your newsfeed because I feel like that's not happening. And maybe if I start posting again regularly, it will start happening. But um, it's it's not been, and it was, to be honest, quite discouraging um, to make a video and only have a couple hundred people watch it. I mean, that's great. I love you guys. I appreciate you. But at one point, and I know this is still like not a lot at all, but I was getting like 1100 1300 views and all of a sudden Facebook changed their algorithms and other people have said this too and then you just your viewership is cut in like half or quarter so I'm hoping that we can get it back up so that I can make more videos more people can see them and we can visit anyway I'm super rambly today this should not have been a 20 minute video and again I'm not going to edit it so I hope you guys enjoyed it Give me a thumbs up again if you did, please, and comment. Let me know where you are and if you liked this. And I'm going to be working on another one with all the ones that are not in this video, but it might be a week before I get that one up. Alrighty, until next time, y'all keep it thrifty.